it's Joanne. I'm back with a little video for you. Um, um, so I wanted to share with you guys what we're doing for our neighbors um, for Easter, what we did for our neighbors for Easter, because I decided this time, and two other people will get them, um, that, you know, most of the people I picked were neighbors anyway. And I'm like, you know, there's like 10 people on my street. I have 12 baskets I'm going to do, so I might as well do it for my neighbors. Then I can pick two other people to give this to. So what we did is little boxes like this. Um, all but three of them will have lids, and I know the, who those will probably go to because I know those people won't mind not getting a lid. Um, but anyway, there's a little bag with a bunch of candy in it. It has some just like trinky, treaty candy, some kisses, some uh, heart chocolate, uh Depending on which bags, there's different ones. Then I have two little Dove candies in here. I have little bags of chips of some sort. There's um, the popcorn ones. There's the Fritos, uh, Cool Ranch Doritos, a couple of Nacho Doritos, and Fungins. Mostly the stuff I won't eat out of my box. And then a couple of my own because I ran out. Some Peeps. Because some of my friends requested I put peeps. They also requested Cadbury eggs be put in. So I put in one of those. I would have put in a whole box for each one. But that was too costly. So I put one in. Then a pad of paper. And a pen. Some hand sanitizer. Or a game. Because I had was two hand sanitizers short of having enough. So I gave a game instead to those two. Because they've gotten the bo boxes before. And they've had the hand sanitizer. And then some little activity. Either a, oh, i got to make sure I change that activity to that one. Oh, well. Anyway, either um, a paint set, um, whether it be like canvas paint or it's like a little ceramic paint, or it's a craft of some sort. So that's what's in these boxes. I think they're really cute. Great little gift to give somebody. And I'm going to make out a note that says something about... We're so grateful to have you as neighbors, and the Easter Bunny said that I should deliver this to you. So, that's what they're going to get, and then I'll put it up in cellophane, tie a ribbon on it, and then I'll deliver them. I'm going to deliver them tomorrow, because I also want to put in a little positive quote um, in each one of them um, before I take them over. So, I'm going to print that up tonight, and then put them in um, my little cross eggs, I think, um, or uh, some, or maybe in... The secondary egg. Because um, I have plenty of those eggs. So. That's what they're all getting. Uh, and we just had a phone call from my aunt. and One of my aunts checking in on us. So that was nice. Uh, she's doing well. She's in her 90s I believe. So yeah. Um, but anyway. So we got to hear from her. And that was really great. Um, although I should have kind of given her my cell phone number for future. Because. My home phone is getting really bad. <laughs> so, um, but it's get, she has a hard time seeing and hearing. So, it, as far as seeing, it would be easier if she kept the old phone number for us. Here, I might try to get that fixed up one of these days here. Um, I do want to tra transfer that and try it. Like, call forward it, I think, is what we decided we're going to do to it. And I'll get a new number on the other cell phone and then give that to most people. For our home number. And then like just call forward the home phone to that number. I think is what we're going to do. Like because we, we've already paid for this. And it's. Yeah. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'll try to do that right after Easter. Um, Mom finishes her. Uh, her med. Tonight I think I figured out. Or tomorrow. It's tonight. I think this is day 7. Because it was Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Yep. Wednesday, today's Thursday. So yeah, she finishes her med tonight for her urinary tract infection. Um, she didn't have dizzy spell too bad last night. She had one minor one, but it cleared like that, which was unusual. It hadn't been that way for a while. Um, and otherwise, she's doing okay. Um, feeling some better, I think. There she is. Oh, well, there's my tree. Yep, it's a little tree. So it's both for the rain... April showers bring May flowers, and then Easter. I kind of mixed the two together on my tree, um, just so it would, you know, be good for the whole month, and I wouldn't have to redecorate. Um, let's see what else is going on. That's it. I'm going to, I said, like I said, I'm going to deliver these boxes tomorrow. I think one's going to go to our priest. 
10 of them are on our street, and then I'm going to pick one other person to receive them. Oh, no, I have the other person. Somebody else asked me to deliver to their family member. So I'm going to deliver to them. And so the 12 boxes are spoken for, and that's what I'm going to do with them. So, okay, guys, I'm going to let you go because I'm going to go get some bread, butter, and mayo from the store because tomorrow is Good Friday, and so I'll have to be meatless again tomorrow. And some of the stuff I use to make my meatless meals, I don't have in the house. I can't do the fasting because of my hypoglycemia. And with mom's health, we really can't fast. Plus, she's over the age that she has to fast anyway. So, um, but because of my health, I can't fast. Um, when I fast, I make myself sick. And that's not a good place to be. So, I'm going to go get that stuff today and see if I can get some more Easter grass. Because three, you know, five of my boxes don't have Easter grass. And I look kind of sad. So, um, that's my goals for today, I think. And then come home and find food, I think. And then, I don't know, I'm just struggling this week a little bit. And it could be because I started my period. What else can I do for baskets? What other ideas do you guys have? Um, my friends on Facebook shared the peeps, the um, Cadbury eggs. And then they also suggested... Um, the Dove chocolates and a, the positive coat, which I'm still going to put in. And then I have one that suggested sidewalk chalk and um, bubbles for kids because it's getting closer to that type of weather. And I'm like, that would be great, but I really, I might throw, you know, something like that in. But the thing is, I really only have one neighbor with kids right now that I could put that in for. So, and they got all that stuff at their house. So I don't want to throw it in theirs because I know what they've got at home because. We spend, they're like extended family, so, um, but yeah, so I'll see what I can do, um, but I bought some to have on hand for future boxes, so if there's any other suggestions, let me know. Um, we're always looking for good ideas. I think maybe I'll vi make a video of my spare, um, my drawer of trinkets that I have on hand. I think I'm going to make you guys a video of that later this month. Or maybe in May you'll get to see it. I'll show you all my extra equipment that I have. I buy after the holidays or I buy whenever I'm in the store. And I'm like, okay, I'm not going to use it this month. And I throw it in the store. And then as I need it or I buy spare, I buy more than what I need for that month. And then I keep it buried in my drawer. And then when it, the next year I can use it or I can use it in the next box or whatever. Because some things I don't care if it's the wrong season. It's just something to throw and give to, you know, give to people when you want to give them a little pick-me-up. So, um, with all that said, I hope you have a good day and I hope it's as beautiful and wonderful as you are. And we'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.